Hello fellow human beings and welcome to a new uh, video. <laughs> Today I'm going to follow a tutorial by Miss Juno Birch. Yes, that's happening. <laughs> happening. So if you do not know who Juno Birch is, then what the hell are you doing? Juno Birch is an amazing um, drag artist. Artista, and she does makeup tutorials. Okay, people, we're going in with the gorgeous wing here. Can you see that? Can you see that? But she also does Sims videos where she just plays the Sims, and those videos are absolutely hilarious. Oh my god, what is happening? Oh my goodness me. Oh my god, Joy Desperate is Oh my god, what on earth is going on? And I thought, I just really feel like transforming myself into the beautiful alien that she is. So, that's what I'm going to do today. And yes, I am indeed wearing purpose merch. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. So, while I was browsing her YouTube channel to find a tutorial that I was gonna follow, there was just one tutorial that really stood out to me. And I think we all know what tutorial that is. <laughs> because she has one cow makeup tutorial. And of course I have to follow that one. I think everybody already knows that. If there is a cow tutorial somewhere, I need to follow it. So, yeah. Without further ado, let's start the transformation. Hello and welcome to another one of my videos. Yesterday, we are going to be doing our makeup. She has like the most amazing music in her videos. Like I really want to know what sound she used because those are perfect, beautiful. Yes. Today. We are going to be doing a lovely and gorgeous cow print inspired makeup video. But before I start, I must remove my sunglasses. Yes, I am currently white as a sheet. <laughs> Does anyone else think that she kind of looks like the Mona Lisa? I don't know, she has like that timeless face or something. It's absolutely stunning. <laughs> but yeah, first things first, I have hair on my forehead and she doesn't. So I'm going to take my glue and try to glue it down. Even though I'm like so bad at gluing down my brows. Like I think I'd rather just shave them off. But I feel like that's kind of too much of a commitment for one video. Or should I? Or should I just shave them? Should I shave them? No, okay. No, 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 no. I'm just gonna glue them down. Okay. Let's zoom into my little face. Hey, this is me. So, I'm gonna take my glue stick and gonna put it all over my goddamn brows. And I have a lot of brows, so I need a lot of glue. <laughs> Why do I have a bald spot over there? <laughs> what? What's going on? Okay, so I got my brows pretty flat. So let's see what she says next. Ooh. I have covered myself with a lovely um, clown white base so that I can, this is the base of the cow print. She starts off with a clown white base to cover her purple skin and I so happen to have that one. At least I think this is the one. The Krylon TV paint stick in white. So, um, let's put this bad boy on me face. Shit. Should I put a primer on my face first? Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> so let's give me entire face with this horrible stuff. That feels like it's going to clog up all my pores. I'm going to try to not put any white stuff on my lips. Because if I do that, then it's going to be very obvious how yellow my teeth actually are. And honestly, I really do not know how my teeth got so yellow. Like, it's... 
It's a mystery to me. <laughs> We're going to start with um, the, um, the the blush. So blush. We're going to go blush. With absolutely stunning oh blush God, this palette, a cute palette from Trixie Mattel Cosmetics, which I absolutely adore. Now the cow print makeup look that I'm going to do today. But what color is she using? Did she show that? Wait. Okay, so she uses the Trixie Mattel blush palette, but she doesn't show which color she's using. So uh, it just looked like a very, very bright pink. So let's go into my collection and see if I have a color like that. I'm going to use the uh, ColourPop Shortcake blush and it's very cute, very pink and uh, very blush. Blending this in, kind of like when I did Marie Antoinette's. Um, very central blush and we're going to do a bit of pink all up the nose now when I do this cow look I like to have quite a pink nose because so we want to make our milkshake bring all of the boys to the yard so okay so we're gonna place it on the apples of the cheek and on the nose because we're gonna bring all of the boys to the yard today I don't want boys on my yard though Let's bring the girls to the yard. <laughs> Recently, I've been using an Anastasia Beverly Hills Cosmetics eyebrow pencil. I like to use it to stencil out where the eyebrows go. Anastasia. And then I sort of draw off. I don't have and those. I'm just gonna go all the way over yes it's happening okay i had to turn on my uh, studio lights because the sun is going crazy today but yeah um let's continue on my eyebrows Ooh, ho, ho. oh god i feel like first of all they're a little bit too high and second of all they're very uneven Oh, how am I going to fix this? This is black. <laughs> Shit. Okay, let's let's see if I can do something about this. The fact that she just draws them on without even thinking about it honestly baffles me. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> This one is better. So I'm just doing a normal eyelid shape that I usually do, but this time I'm going to go slightly higher. And then instead of going right into the nose, I'm actually gonna go straight down. More clown shaped. Cl we love a clown shaped eye. Think more Bianca Del Rio um, eye shape. Okay, so we, I guess we have to use a dark blue one and make some cow-like eyes <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah! <laughs> why did I do that oh. I'm gonna use this um, a blue moon palette by Colourpop cosmetics I'm gonna like, be clued in eyeshadow and then I'm gonna Create some cow eyes? No, 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 clown eyes. <laughs> Why was she saying cow eyes? I don't know what kind of eyes cows have actually. Okay. Even the eyeshadow is uneven. But I guess it kind of matches my uneven eyebrows. So we're just gonna roll with it. Blending is the secret yes it is okay so i'm just blending it out very nicely i'm gonna take a small tiny brush and blend it out because blending is the secret i mean she wasn't lying when she said that blending was a secret because this already looks a lot better yeah i still look like a clown but i feel like that's kind of what we're going for so everything is going great now usually i would use 
white crayon to set my eyelids with and mark out my creases. Oh. But I thought I'd treat myself today. Oh and I bought, I spent about £45. I don't usually spend much money on makeup. Me neither. But I actually treated myself to some of these um, P. Louise um, P. Louise. eye bases, which are quite expensive, I'm not going to lie. We're going to use this flat brush. I don't have the P. Louise. And mix that in. Okay, right, okay, okay. Oh my god, this flat brush works wonders, people. <laughs> okay, so I don't have the P. Louise. Also, I'm just noticing that she actually didn't use a blue, but she used a purple eyeshadow. So this is all going terribly wrong. Oh my god, this color looks so much different than from what she's using. Oh. It looked blue in the video, but it's not. Can I fix it? Of course I can't fix it. Okay, I'm gonna use this, this purple on top of it. Just slightly to see if I can make it look more purple than blue. Because it's, it's very blue right now. And apparently that was not supposed to happen. I had no idea. It's a little bit better now. Okay, so I'm gonna take my Krylon white stick. And a little bit of this like cream color from DM Cosmetics. I'm gonna mix it together and see if I can create a lilac color. Yeah, that was what we're going for. This, I guess this works. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna take a lovely brush and I'm gonna take this sugar pill palette that has a beautiful lavender tone in it. And I don't have that palette. That to mat our lids. Yes, that is happening. Happening. Um, yes, I absolutely adore sugar pill makeup. I guess this one will do, which is from Urban Decay. I feel like that might have been a little bit too dark. Okay. And now what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do the exact same thing with this eye. I'm just gonna plonk this all over. Feels like it's gone on smoother. And it looks like I'm not gonna get any of those creases, but we shall see. Any of those creases. My entire face is covered in those creases. <laughs> my skin and my eyeballs look so bad right now like i really wonder if this is what drag queens look like in real life <laughs> because this is actually like disgusting disgusting <laughs> my skin looks like it's gonna fall off maybe i should have actually used the primer i don't know oh my god yeah. stunning 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 oh my god absolutely look at that people look at the blendage yeah, it's amazing. look at the blendage look at the blend don't look at my blendage <laughs> yeah we're gonna take the color underneath the eyeballs as well So, <laughs> these are the eyes, and I'm just gonna go over the eyebrows with some black eyeliner, because I like living on the edge. Okay, continue. So, I'm going to use this, um, which I've tested already, and it's absolutely stunning, and we're gonna just go, yes. But I just wanna say, Whoa. Before, this is really really oh my gosh she put that eyeliner on real quick <laughs> what just happened so i'm going to uh draw on a very thick eyeliner and i should know how to do this but for some reason now that the pressure is very high i suddenly feel like i've never done eyeliner in my life before <laughs> damn this like immediately Changes the whole look. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Shit. Shit. Also, and this is the wonderful world of who the eyelids. <laughs> the only way for me to do thick eyeliner is to just fill my entire eyelid in with eyeliner. I hate it here. <laughs> Yeah, look at all this eyeliner, damn. 
honestly eyeliner just makes everything a lot better like now it actually looks like it was supposed to be this way um, a few minutes earlier it just looked like I fell face down into my makeup stash and I'm going to use this Pat McGrath eye 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 mascara very faint line that is going to separate the um, oh my god gorgeous absolutely gorgeous but before I go on to the cow print I'm going to put on some really beautiful gorgeous cow print. lashes and oh my god people can we just talk oh my about god, those are like tops? really gorgeous <sighs> like look at that people Damn. look how much difference that makes to the look bring me the axe I don't think I have lashes that big okay wait so uh, I'm going to put some mascara on some eyeliner underneath the eyes and some big old lashes Okay, perfect. My lashes have just disappeared into my eyeliner. <laughs> For lashes, it turns out I actually do own a few <laughs> big lashes. <laughs> I got these on AliExpress because I thought that they would look hella cute. But just look at how big they are. Like this... Who puts this on their eyes when they're not doing a drag look? They, these are ridiculously long, like what? I think I'm gonna need a gallon of eyelash glue to be able to stick these on my eyes. <laughs> it's so big. It's so big. Oh no, 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 no. Oh god. Why am I so messy? I don't like it. I'm going to put on lipstick now. Usually I use out liquid lipstick, but today I'm going in with a gorgeous Anastasia Beverly Hills Cosmetics um, matte wheelie lipstick. Oh, look at that, people. Okay, so for lips, we're gonna have to go for a very round shape. So I think I'm gonna have to take this bad boy out because otherwise it's just not gonna work, I think. So let's take this boy. Uh, uh. Damn, you're tight. Look at this hole. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Why do I feel the need to punch holes through my body? She. Oh. Oh my god. This is such a look. Last time I did the cow print makeup, I used a eyeliner, a liquid eyeliner, and it took me ages to do. Um, so I'm not going to do that this no. time. I'm actually going to use Meron makeup. It's like um, it's like black snazaroo. Black snazaroo? What the hell is that? Oh right, okay. That's absolutely. Oh my god, this is really good, people. Oh now, the thing is, I really enjoy drawing cow print. So I'm not even thinking about where this is going, people. I'm literally just doing it randomly. <laughs> when I do stuff randomly, it literally always turns out bad. Like I need to think about every little detail that I'm going to do. Otherwise, I'll end up looking like a clown. Like I'm doing right now. <laughs> So I'm just going to do what she also did, and that's just draw some black spots on my body, on my body. My god, I actually already really love it. Look, I'm a cow. Oh, this is so cute. So I got the majority done. I'm now going to do, I'm just going to put a wig on, put some clothing on, that's hopefully kind of going to fit this look. And then I'll be right back with the actual end result. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, be right back. you guys this is the end result of today's video oh my god i absolutely love this look so much i feel like this is just how i'm actually supposed to look like 
for some reason this feels so natural to me <laughs> kind of sad that it takes me hours to do because i want to walk around like this every day this is perfect this is beautiful this is amazing oh my god just look at it <laughs> also yeah i'm trying to hide my hands because my human hands are kind of messing with the fantasy it kind of looks like i have hooves actually <laughs> So yeah, um, thank you Juno Birch for creating that tutorial because I feel absolutely amazing right now and that wouldn't have happened without you. So thank you. Um, I'll of course make sure to leave all the links to her like a YouTube channel and Instagram in the description box down below so you can check her out for yourself in case you haven't done that yet. And uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna go now and make a ridiculous amount of pictures of myself because I am feeling myself. Thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you in my next video. Ciao, ciao, bye bye. bye, -bye. Oh, no, 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 no human hands. Wait. Ciao, ciao, bye bye. Kiss, 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 kiss. Oh, wait. I have to show my glasses. I haven't even put my glasses on yet. Oh, damn. I think I actually prefer it without the glasses. Because I spent so much time on this eyeliner. <laughs> That I don't want to hide it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bye.